Hi there, this is Liz and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another Dollar Tree haul that I would like to share with you. So without any further ado, let's get started. So I went to the Dollar Tree specifically looking for fall florals. Um, I need more of them, um, but our Dollar Tree is pretty picked through. But I did find a few stems, so I picked up this wheat uh, bouquet. This has some nice uh, neutral colors of wheat and some flowers and a couple of these little berry stems in here. And so I took this one. And then I picked up this fall foliage stem. I, uh, I think it has some pieces missing. I'm not sure because this was the only one they had. But uh, I need the leaves, so I took it anyway. It does have a couple of uh, little berries in here. But I really needed the leaves, so I uh, took what they had. And then I took this maple oak garland. Now this is a five foot garland, but as you can see, it is fairly sparse and it has only a few leaves on here. But I will be taking these leaves off and using them elsewhere. But I will save this and make my own garland out of this. It is still usable even if I take the leaves off. So then I picked up two of these Boo lanterns. Now I don't want to use these for Halloween decor so I will be cutting these out. Now these are LED lanterns with an on and off switch and a flickering effect. So here you have your on and off switch and this lantern uses two AAA batteries so they do not come with batteries. And then I picked up two bottles of paint. This is acrylic paint by Acrylogy. This is just plain white, but this is like a pale yellow, but the color is called sea sand. So this is a pretty color. Now our Dollar Tree used to carry this acrylic paint, but I cannot find it at our Dollar Tree anymore. It's kind of slowly been disappearing and it's been replaced with this brand. Now these bottles have 118 ounces in there and these do as well. And I think this is just as good because I already have a few bottles of different colors of this and used it and I think it is just as good so but I need paint anyway. I also picked up two of these white glass candle holders. I could only find one of these and I could only find one of these but that is okay because I did want something different than I already had and they don't always have to be the same. And then I picked up a roll of this natural jute cord. I needed this to finish up some projects that I had started and this is by Shore Living and this is a nice size roll of jute cord. There's quite a bit here so it will last me for a while. And I also picked up two of these decor pieces. I'm pretty sure this is wall decor and this is a glow in the dark but I don't want to use these for a wall art though. I want to use these for a DIY and I needed something that was exactly the same size. So and then these are hollow in the back and they're just like a little box or a little tray. So these were perfect for what I have in mind and they are exactly the same size. And Christmas is out at our Dollar Tree. So I picked up two of these plain DIY ornaments. These are perfect for making your own gorgeous Christmas decor and these are a nice size. They also carry smaller ones of these but I already have them and did not need them at this time but they were there. I also picked up this cute mini wreath. Now this has the feel of the microfabric dusting cloths and I'm pretty sure it's foam underneath with a bell on top of the ribbon with a little bit of green wreath and this is by Christmas House. I think this is actually new to Dollar Tree. I don't recall seeing these last year, but these are super cute. They will be perfect for Christmas DIYs. I also picked up four of these acrylic deer. These are also from Christmas House. And these are really nice decor pieces um, to decorate with for Christmas or winter decor. You can do so many, many things with these. You can paint them, leave them as they are. Even if you don't like using these for Christmas decor, this is a perfect
perfect winter decor piece. So these are really nice to have. I already have two, but I thought I could use four more. And then I picked up this gorgeous Santa decor piece. Now he is a nice size. He is approximately five or six inches tall. I haven't measured it, but, but he is just a nice size. And also from Christmas House. And I'm pretty sure this is new to Dollar Tree this year because I have not seen this one there before. If they had these last year, I must have missed them. But um, I think he might be new. You could use this piece just as he is, as a shelf sitter, or you could add him to a lot of your uh, Christmas DIYs. But either way, I couldn't leave him behind. He was just too cute to leave behind. And then here's another one that I think might be new to Dollar Tree, also from Christmas House. I don't recall seeing these there uh, last year, but these are cute. This is just a snowman head, but you could use these for so many things. You can use them just as they are, as a Christmas tree ornament, and just hang them on your Christmas tree, or you could use them in many different DIYs. Now I wish I had taken a little bit of closer look at him in the store because this cheek is a little bit lower than this cheek, and so I'm going to have to see if I can fix him up. But either way, he is cute and might be new as well. I'm not sure. Now here's another one that may be new to Dollar Tree. I don't recall seeing these last year, but maybe they did have them. Maybe I just missed them. And this is also from Christmas House. And this is a snowman with a red hat. I only took one of these, but they did have the ones with the black hats. Um, like the fedora style hats, I think is what they're called. This is a perfect size to use for DIYs, or you can just take this tag off and hang him on a tree. And even if you don't like this snowman, you can use him for parts. You could take the arms off and the nose and the eyes and even the hat and scarf, and you have all these parts to build your own snowman. He is super cute. And here is another one that I think is new to Dollar Tree. I don't recall seeing these there before. Also by Christmas House. This is just super cute. A little sweater mitten. A little mitten with a fur rim. And it is just, I think this is foam in here. But it is soft and cute. Now for me, I think I would change this up a little bit. This pine cone with these leaves here. But even so, it is cute just as it is and uh, ready to hang on your Christmas tree. And here is another one also by Christmas House that I think this is new to Dollar Tree this year. I don't recall ever seeing these at Dollar Tree before. And this is cute just as it is. You could use this in a tiered tray on a wall, you can hang it on a Christmas tree, or you could just take this apart and use the blocks on a tiered tray and use these parts in other uh, DIYs. But other than that, I thought this was too cute to leave behind. And I think I might just um, use it just as it is because it is adorable. Here's another one by a Christmas house. Now these I think they had last year, but I'm not 100% sure. Now I only picked up one of these and now I'm thinking I should have really just gotten two. They are cute. Now these are just a uh, hard cardboard, I think is what they're made of. And then um, they have a little bit of design and a little bit of sparkle. Now I wish I'd gotten two of these because they are cute and they are perfect for uh, different DIYs. You could um, take these off and personalize them and make them your own to fit your decor pieces. But they are cute just as they are to hang on a tree. And then lastly, I picked up this Welcome to Our House wall hanging. I have no immediate plans for this, but I thought I would pick it up anyway. Um, I can switch these up at any time. If I don't come up with any ideas for this piece, I can just take it apart and use any one of these parts where I need them in other decor pieces. So that is my Dollar Tree haul for today. Thanks for watching.